Good evening, race fans. Good evening, world. It's Marky B here, aka the Scruffy Toff, welcoming you along to a impromptu uh, commentary on our historic heroes special event this evening. I uh, was planning on driving in it myself, but uh, uh, it's cars between 1950 and 1969, so I bought a three and a half million credit Lamborghini Mura. Uh, road car and every other sod bar ginger ninja i think has <laughs> has turned up in a race car so uh bollocks to that i thought i'd just uh have a bit of chat instead so uh yeah we've got th we've got three 15 minutes uh, good evening human titan we've got three 15 minute sprint races the first of which is at brands hatch uh God knows where the other two are. We're thinking maybe Goodwood and Big Willow, but uh, don't know. We will see in the fullness of time. So we have uh, Willie Ham in some sort of jag, splatter in a feather, Big Easy in a feather. God knows what he's done to it. The state of that. How dare he do that to a Ferrari? Uh, Spiffy G in a sort of GT40-ish race car type thing co by ashimaru in the alpine 220 i think that is uh macgyver also in the alpine and ginger <laughs> ginger ninja in miss marple's car um <laughs> oh dear yeah lovely Lovely. I think the, the VR boys are going to love it, but uh, I'm not sure anyone else is. So we're uh, halfway through Quali at the moment, and at the moment it's Willie Ham in pole by 19 hundredths of a second in the Shagwar. That's a great looking motor, that is. Currently down on his fastest lap, splatter in the. 330 P4, I think it is. He was ahead of Big Easy in the same car. Crikey, that's not going to go down well. Come on, James. Let's see if he uh, can beat his 125.8. Nope. James, 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 what have you done to that poor Ferrari? Deary me. And Spiffy, my usual co-commentator, but uh, as this is impromptu, he's <laughs> he's actually picked a decent car to uh, run in this evening. Although <laughs> going wide as hell there. Yeah, well, exactly, Human Titan. What did Ferrari do to him? Quite, quite. <laughs> I don't know. I... Maybe they let him down on a delivery date or something. Don't know. But uh, yes, it's not nice. Not nice. Okay, so we're at the wonderful Brands Hatch in Kent this evening. Which should be interesting because the <laughs> these cars. <laughs> You get a you. Oh no! <laughs> so uh, yes, uh, James helpfully parked his car right across the track just after Sheen Curve, and uh, <laughs> Spiffy did did his best not to T-bone him there. But uh, I think with that uh, livery he's got on, you had every right, mate. I'd have uh, gone straight in. But it's pretty close at the top. Willie Ham still not. <laughs> Ginger Ninja just drifting it out of Druids there. Lovely stuff. <laughs> oh, great. I thought I'd picked a shit car until I, <laughs> until I saw what Ginger Ninja was in. <laughs> Actually, might have stood a chance of not coming last. Uh, but uh, okay, so Splatter is he's only 0.19 down. <laughs> Human Titan, do you think you got the slipstream from that that 
Carl Ginger Ninja's in his back. <laughs> it's about uh, six inches wide. Okay, come on, Splatter. Next time check. Oh, he's 0.18 down. Okay. The guys have asked me to stay in chat, so I'm hoping they can kind of hear me. Um, okay, Willie's just gone faster. 0.38 now. Yep. Okay, Human Titan, thank you very much for that. You're my second pair of eyes this evening, which I so desperately need. Good stuff. Big Easy in the desecration of the Ferrari. Seems to be struggling a bit in that. Which is, uh... Yeah, okay, that's... Uh... Very wide through Druids. But he's okay, but he's 0 0.17 up on his lap. Clearly that is the line. So as I say, I've got no idea what the other two uh, tracks are going to be post this race, but uh, we will see in the fullness of time. Um, probably some old school ones. <clears throat> I think it may be Monza as well, right? Okay, he's 0.495 up. He still needs to eke out another three tenths or so to leap ahead of Splatter into second. Yeah, that's not going to help. Okay, no, now he's down. Now, oh, bad luck, James. These old cars are quite unwieldy, and uh, yeah, as I <laughs> as I found to my cost in my beautiful Mura, which is an absolute nightmare to drive unless you're going in a straight line. So uh, yeah, okay. So have a look at Spiffy. See how he's getting on. Down on his fastest. <laughs> Rest alive. Who went off there? Was that splatter? Uh, yeah, Splatter just exited stage right, coming out of Graham Hill there. <laughs> right, there's, there's cars all over the place. <laughs> this could be an interesting evening. Could be an interesting evening. So Ginger Ninja currently uh, 10.2 seconds down on sixth place. Uh, he's trying to drive off the track, but it keeps resetting him. <laughs> Just hit um, control and get out of there, mate. Don't you? <laughs> it's not going to work, Ginger Ninja. It's going to reset you. Oh, yeah, there you go. <laughs> For the fourth time. <laughs> Yeah, just hit um, uh, whatever the uh, settings button is and get the hell out of Dodge, mate. Um, <laughs> beautiful looking car, though. Beautiful looking car. Um, if you're an elderly lady. <laughs> okay, so we're at the end of quality. Is anyone still going? MacGyver's pissing about and reversing over the line. Well done, well done, man. I take it that wasn't his best lap. Yeah, so Ginger News is exactly the uh, position I thought I was going to be in. What's happened to Merchel Argo? I thought he was... Uh... Okay, well, obviously thought better of it, or maybe he's fallen asleep. Don't know. Okay, so we have seven cars this evening. <laughs> Beautiful stuff. Well done, Ginger. Super. Wonderful. There we go. Uh, if everyone just goes into the pits. Yes, <laughs> he did human titan. He did indeed. He did. 
so again, I apologise for anyone in chat because I it just pops up at the bottom right hand corner of my screen for a very limited time. So uh, I will do my best to respond. A log and talk of the devil, and he shall arrive. Hello, A log. Thanks for joining me. A bit of an impromptu session. <laughs> <laughs> right, so just rushing through the grid quickly. You've got Willie Ham in first in the uh, Jag Shagwar Jag 125.4. Splatter in the 330p4, 125.8. Big Easy, the 330p4, and a 125.9. Spiffy G in the Mark IV race car 67, a 127.7. Kobayashi Maru in the A220. Uh, 128.0, MacGyver in the A220, 128.9, and then Ginger Ninja in the, I think it's a Maserati, A6 GCS stroke 53 Spider 54, and a 139.1. So there you go. There you go. Uh, racing soft this evening, minimal tyre degradation and fuel usage. It's a 15 minute sprint. And uh, yes, <laughs> frankly, good luck, everyone. And Justin's given me absolutely no time to take a sip of my uh, vino. And I've been asked to do this this evening in a typically vintage voice, so we'll give that a bash until I get um, uh, annoyed with it. And here we are at the historic Brands Hatch. The boys are just lining up. And they're off! Splatter gets a tremendous start, as does Big Easy. He goes flying past Willie Ham into a Paddock. Oh, Splatter got that all wrong. Okay. <laughs> I think Jijin must have had a shocking start there. He's absolutely miles behind. Through Graham Hill. Big Easy seems to have uh, finally found something. As he is in the lead. Oh, and Willie nearly loses it there. Ooh, a bit of a bit of a kiss there from Spiffy G as he comes uh, down towards Hawthorns. And the two Alpines line astern. <laughs> yes, Spiffy won't be very happy about that. Let Willie up the inside. Hand off for the first time. So coming up to complete lap one. We have Big Easy, followed by Splatter, followed by Willie Ham, followed by Spiffy G, and Kobayashi Maru, Matt MacGyver, the Alpine still lined astern, and Ginger Ninja. Who is <laughs> a substantial distance behind? These are unwieldy cars, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, well, I think that's enough of that. Um, okay, so we've got the top three breaking away, well, no, top four. Breaking away from the uh, Alpine brothers. Oh dear, Big Easy's gone wide. Oh God, <laughs> where did it? So, oh, Big Easy made a complete rickets of. Uh, oh no! <laughs> oh dear. So, uh, Spiffy G and uh, yeah, Big Easy had a bit of a coming together, I think, but I don't think Spiffy could do an awful lot about it. To be fair. Uh, now Splatter is leading the way in the Ferrari with Willie Ham in the uh, Shaguar breathing down his neck. Seems to be holding station at the moment, though. 
Splatter with the fastest lap so far, 126.3. Okay, so Spiffy has, yeah, he's got about a, well, just over a half a second lead over, oh no, <laughs> that makes an absolute rickets of his exit on, <laughs> I think, I don't know if he tagged MacGyver there, but MacGyver certainly got the uh, raw end of that deal, and uh, is currently trying to pick up bits of his car just uh, outside of Graham Hill. Uh, okay. <laughs> it's going to be an interesting race. K by Ashimaru in his Alpine. Hurtling down Hawthorns. Nicely done, Justin. That thing's got absolutely colossal rear tyres. They're proper Carlos Fandangos. No way you'd be getting oversteer with big bastards like that on the back. Uh, same for MacGyver. Weird looking car though, that Alpine really is quite weird. And Ginger Ninja, out for a country drive. Good evening, Vicar. Okay, so we've got Splatter and Woody Ham coming through Druids. Through Graham Hill. So the top three are all VR balls. So let's not uh, ask them about that. Nicely done. Splatter's definitely holding station. So, good stuff, Rob. Keep it up, mate. It's 0 0.6, nearly 0 0.7 up on his fastest lap of the race thus far. Ooh. A couple of tyres on the grass there. Yellow flags. Christ, okay, so that's down to point two now. <laughs> I wonder when the uh, car horns were. Yeah. yeah, okay, Human Titan, knew what you meant. <laughs> oh, okay, so Ginger uh, Ninja is just. Going to be lapped for, I suspect, probably not the last time. <laughs> Decides to do some drifting which is down the straight, which is interesting. Interesting tactic there. Keep the boys on their toes. Good work. <laughs> oh, dear, dear, dear. I wish you could pick your own uh, sort of car horn noise as well. Sort of a ha 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 sort of thing would be funny. Um, or the uh, old klaxon. <laughs> that would also be good. So I can only say I thank God I've muted the chat because I imagine Rob is going to be breathing like... Uh, yeah, well, I don't know what the granny on a sex chat line, I suppose. Um. <laughs> oh, dear. But he's hanging on for grim death here and doing a hell of a job, frankly. So keep it up, Rob. Good stuff. That feather is quick. It's pulling away from the jag down the straight. I'm 
squealing of tyres as they go through Hawthorns into the corner I can't remember the name of and down towards Sheen Curve which is frankly the toughest corner on the entire track nicely done splatter putting it out to over a second now good man Right, I've given these enough airtime. Let's get back to see how um, Big Easy is getting on in his. Well, I don't know what you call that. Well, obviously, it's a Ferrari, but uh, it looks bloody awful. Hmm. Blasphemy! Blasphemy! Stone him! Okay, so Big E's currently a bit of no man's land. He's got five seconds to Willie Ham, six seconds back to Spiffy. So no surprises, Spiffy has picked a Yank tank this evening. Oh, we have a prediction. We have a prediction. Human Titan is guessing lap seven or eight is where Willie will overtake Splatter. Well... That remains to be seen. And we've got uh, Koboy Ashimaru, 16 back from Spiffy. MacGyver, 3 back from Koboy Ashimaru. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, I, I see Ginger Ninjas into the pits. Uh, I think this may be a 10-minute pit stop. Don't blame you, mate. Jump on comms if you like. I'll unmute you. Okay, well, let's see if Human Titan's prediction comes true. And This is lap eight. Rob's doing a hell of a job, to be fair. Um, Willie's been all over his chuff for... <laughs> At least sort of four or five laps now. Sheen Curve, nicely done. This does appear to be the race on track. I'll just, yeah, so Ginger's uh, getting his quiche and uh, Bollinger out. MacGyver's pulling up on the back of Kobe Ashimaru, and then there's daylight between the rest. So this is the race on track. It's Italy versus England. Uh, from a manufacturer's point of view, and it's the Cotswolds versus the Isle of Sheppey from a driver geography point of view. So we've got, we've got probably, so we've got, uh, it's 15 minute sprint, so just coming 12 minutes, so probably three laps left. That Jag does look great, to be fair. It's absolutely planted. <laughs> oh, Rob was on the raggedy edge there. Fantastic stuff. Through Sheen Curve, yeah. Oh, brilliant. They're pushing these cars so hard. They're absolutely using every bit of the track fantastic so you know, big easy and managing to let's have a look uh oh. 
cockpit cam. This is what we'll see at the moment in his silly white helmet that he wears. Oh no, we're dog! God! Splatter goes wide into the kissy litter. And through goes Willy into the lead. Yeah, bad luck, Rob. Bad luck. You've still got a minute, two and a half minutes, mate. Sorry, everyone. I keep on pressing a button for some reason, and uh, so you can't see all the details. <clears throat> okay, so Willie in the Shagwar is pulling away the dairy milk Shagwar. Glass and a half in every tank. Great looking motor, that isn't it? Super. So, I think probably on to the last lap now. Big Easy in third, Spiffy G in fourth. Yeah, daylight between him and K. Boy Maru, who's in fifth. Uh, MacGyver in sixth, and oh, Ginger Ninja's back out on track. <laughs> interesting, <laughs> interesting line, and uh, yeah, wow, look at that. <laughs> Clearly, he needs. <laughs> Beautiful stuff, Ginger Ninja. Okay, so Kayashi Maru has finished. We've got Willie. Where is he now? Coming into Sheen Curve. Beautifully done. <laughs> yes, exactly, Human Titan. Kind of back on track, but not really. Okay, so Willie just coming around the final corner. Okay, and uh, slides it across the line. Splatter, brilliant drive. Uh, nearly <laughs> MacGyver pissing about on the line didn't help. And uh, Big Easy through into third. Uh, Spiffy G in the Yank Tank. And coming through into fourth. Uh, Ginger Ninja's still going. Oh, no, he's still going. Fabulous. So if you can hear me, Ginger Ninja, you are beaming live to the world in your Maserati, or whatever the hell it is. Quite sure how he's still going, to be honest. Uh, given that K.Y. Ashimaru MacGyver finished the lap. Yeah, oh, I don't know. The wonders of computers and the internet and all things like that. Yeah, so a bit of a bit of chat going on between Alog and Human Titan. Yeah, Human Titan, do I, I did see that? I assumed that was you, Titan Mech or whatever it was. Um, well done, Simon. <laughs> uh, just broke his driver's neck by uh, piling into the uh, barrier there. Yeah, do jump on board, but you can, mate. Be great to have you. So, race one of our historic heroes special event. And first place in the Shagwar, Willie Ham, with the best lap of 125.0. In second, Splatter in the Ferrari 330p4, with the fastest lap of the race at 124.9. Big Easy in his absolute abortion of a Ferrari uh, p4, uh, 125.8. Fourth, Spiffy G uh, in the Ford something or other, uh, 126.7. Kobayashi Baru in the Alpine 220, 128.2. Uh, 
MacGyver in the Alpine 220, a 128.1, and Ginger Ninja in seventh, five laps back, and a 137.3. Right. Oh, God. <laughs> now, this is uh, Sardinia. So, if we just moved on to the next um, track, Sardinia Road Track B. Hmm. Okay. I wasn't expecting that. And is there a reverse grid? I'm not sure. Sorry, I'm just about to sneeze. Okay, this is quite a twisty, turny with uh, track with uh, some really sharp corners. So this should be uh, <laughs> an absolute nightmare. Uh, so yeah, okay, turn one as always will be interesting. Uh, the Mark IV is a road boat. Okay, Human Titan, no worries, mate. Thank you so much for joining. See you again soon. Good stuff. So the guys are getting a, a little bit of practice, I think. Because I was due to be racing, I didn't actually bother looking at uh, whether it's reverse grid from the first race or what. But uh, I'll just try and find out now, viewer, so that... Uh, oh. Okay, straight into it. What the hell's going on there? Who's <laughs> okay, Ginger did just change his car. <laughs> right. Okay, so MacGyver's changed his car to some sort of open wheeler type thing. <laughs> oh no! Big Easy has got off. Oh dear. And Splatter is away again. <laughs> yes. Good point, eh, look. Good point. I think it's for the cannibal run, isn't it? Where the Italian guy uh, rips... No, no, not the, not the cannibal run. The other one, the gumball rally, where the uh, Italian guy rips the uh, rear view mirror off, throws it behind him and says, what's behind me does not matter. So, yes, uh, splatter, do that. So Splatter has launched away into a nearly five-second lead already over Willie Ham, who's got... Uh, MacGyver in uh, looks like a Lego Technic set behind him. But Willie really is pulling away down the straight. I'm guessing that um, well, whatever it is is going to make it up in the corners, maybe. Oh dear! MacGyver gets it sideways. Oh, we got we, we got Big Easy and Cowboy Ashi Maru having some something of a ding dong. A bit of a touch coming into the left hander, and Cowboy Ashi Maru sends it up the inside. Beautifully done. And now Ginger Ninja's in the... Is that the Alpine as well? We've got three Alpines on... Oh, no, sorry, two Alpines on track because MacGyver's uh, 
swapped to the uh, Lego Technics set. And Big Easy tries to throw it up the inside of uh, Ginger Ninja there. Ginger Ninja seems to be a bit more happy. That is gone past Kobayashi Maru as well. Wow! On the controller tonight, Simon is quite sure why. Has he got a spanking new G923 or whatever it is, uh, wheel? Oh no, Ginger Ninja's back in sixth now. Oh, mm, crikey, okay. Must have gone off. Missed that. And Spiffy G just going past Ginger Ninja. Okay, back up to the top. So Splatter is maintaining his a 4.8 second lead over Willy Ham. Only 12 minutes to go, Rob. I should just say this is all a bit of fun this evening. So as all our special events have been, which frankly have been an absolute blast. Um, we've had several different formats uh, in our off season in between uh, our usual group three group four uh, same car sunday um, and oh we've got group two this this season starting again as well uh, but it's been it, oh no <laughs> oh god okay so oh willie's gonna have to tank past him here surely Rob lost it on the second last corner. Okay, sorry, I keep hitting that bloody button. Okay, yeah, so Rob goes wide. Will he take, goes up the inside? Okay, and will he's through to the lead? Bad luck, Rob. But he's right up his chuff. Just need to keep it there and then fly past him on the straight, mate. I think you might have it in a straight line. This flick pack. MacGyver's got Kobayashi Maru for company. Oh. <laughs> And Kobayashi Maru goes past, but he has a half-second penalty. And MacGyver takes the outside line and launches it. Big Easy throws it up the inside. You yeah, try not to tap MacGyver's car. It looks like it could just fall apart, fall apart with the merest tap. You know, like one of those clown cars. The uh, tyres fly off in different directions and... Uh, Christ alive, what was going on this? If he's lost it. Ah, oh, Ginger Ninja into sixth. Okay, so Big Easy was a bit wide there, so K by Ashimaru has got the run on him, potentially. Okay, between three and six, this is pretty close. It's going to oh, splatter. What are you doing? Gone off again. So Winnie is away into the sunset. With okay, nine minutes to go. <laughs> Spiffy G has dirty tyres and uh, the Ford does not like dirty tyres. Yeah, probably clean them up a bit, mate. Yeah, that'll do it. <laughs> Epic! Beautiful stuff from Spiffy there. Absolutely no idea. Was that the Honda A2 
seven whatever it was that we we had a an open wheel special event um and it was the one because you didn't, you can only buy it in the legends dealership and uh I, I didn't have one so i had to sit that round out but uh i think it was a good wood as well it looked like an absolute hoot so i think that's what it is as a honda a two seven whatever And uh, Ginger is uh, looking a lot happier in his Alpine now. Not quite sure why you say Alpine, because it's spelled Alpine, but uh, there you go. What of life's little foibles. Okay, we've got Big Easy, who is about to serve a half-second penalty. God, that's a weird place for the penalty line. I'd have given him more than that for the uh, livery he's put on his car, to be honest. Um, but uh, James obviously loves it. <laughs> Didn't lose a place, though. So he, as is, in third place. Eight behind Splatter. One and a half between, uh, in front of Kobayashi Maru. Uh, Willie is marching off into the distance in the 13 and a half second lead. Oh, listen to that shagwar. Nice. Yeah, so Splatter has a seven second, seven and a bit second lead over Big Easy. Seems to be struggling with the Ferrari this evening. Do that pretty well though. So we've got the Alpines, line of stern, coming down the start, finish straight. Okay, by Ashimaru, followed closely by Ginger and Ninja. Ginger Ninja sliding it around like no one's business there. Half a second between these two. Let's see where... Okay, so there's daylight between this lot, so we'll stick with the uh, race on track, which is the Battle of the Alpines. Whoa! -ho -ho -ho! Uh, that was a close one. Blimey. Now, has Ginger Ninja managed to... Is he going to be able to launch it out of the final corner? better than Kobay Ashimaru, get a toe and try and take him into turn one. Let's have a look. Okay, there's an apex there somewhere, boys. Bosh! Bit of a bit of a love tap there from Ginger Ninja to our team principal. So he hangs back and uh, lets him go. Beautifully done. So we've got two and three quarter minutes left. <laughs> and I can't stay in this view. 
with uh, Simon on controller because it's me. He's giving me motion sickness. Whoa! <laughs> Ginger Ninja throws it up the inside and uh, taps Cowboy Ashimaru, gives the place back beautifully. That Christ Almighty! <laughs> and a half second penalty for his trouble. Okay, so Willie's now 25 seconds ahead. He's clearly found his groove on this particular layout, and off he goes into the sunset. Big Easy now up into second, so he's managed to get past Splatter. But with a 15 point taste bone, a 15 second taste bonus coming up for his livery, uh, Splatter should be okay for second place still. Okay. <laughs> Ginger Ninja is flying all over the shop this evening. I think um Yeah, maybe his missus uh penalized him for being a naughty boy or something and he uh, <laughs> couldn't have his wheel out this evening, so he's been forced to use the controller. I don't know. <laughs> But, oh my god. Christ. <laughs> oh, epic work from Chinchin Ninja. Okay, boy, well, actually, Maru probably breathing a sigh of relief, to be fair. Uh, right, so we're just coming up. Oh, wait, wait, he's picked up a penalty? What? Good grief. But he's miles ahead and okay 15 minutes are up so i'm guessing this is the final lap which it is okay so willie just coming up and he's weaving all over the shop beautifully done win number two of this evening all right splatter you got last shot <laughs> absolutely nail it out of the final corner See if you can get a toe. Okay, there. Looks like third for Rob. Second for Mr. Finley in the P330. And uh, third for Rob in the same. Co by Ashimaru just coming through to take fourth. <laughs> Ginger Ninja. <laughs> Uh, he's uh, yeah, definitely trying to make sure he gets the best out of his, or use the most amount of his tyres. Uh, in fifth, oh, it says MacGyver in sixth. Oh, so it was Spiffy a lap back. Blimey. It mean, did look like he was having a bit of a nightmare, but uh, okay, there we have it. So, race number two, uh, Willie Ham in first in the Shagwar, 120.3. I mean, that's second ahead of anyone else. Big Easy in second. In the Feza, a 121.2. Splatter in third in a 121.1. Kobayashi Maru in the Alpine, a 123.9. Uh, Ginger Ninja in fifth in the Alpine, a 123.6. Uh, Matt MacGyver in the Honda RA272, a 126.2. And Spiffy G, um, who looked like he was having all sorts of problems in the Ford Mark IV race car, uh, 123.6. So there we go. One to go. And Christ, we're straight into it. Now, <laughs> what track are we on now? Uh, hang on. 
That's Sardinia again. That can't be right. Oh, is it reverse grid? Yeah, okay. Disappointing. Hang on, there's only four guys on track. No. Yep, thought there was a bit of a faux pas there. Okay, so we're just waiting to see what happened there. I'll just check Discord to see if there's any communications. I'll chop, just pop you on mute viewer whilst I uh, sip my libation and uh, try and find out what the Sam Hill is going on. Okay, no update as yet and no lobby back online, so bear with me, viewer, and I will, uh, well, literally viewer, I think, A-log, uh, bear with me and we'll see uh, if the lobby comes back online. And it has. Okay. Just... Uh, let me get a drink, two seconds. Okay, lobby's back up, and we are at the Red Bull Ring, uh, which I didn't expect at all. So that's uh, that's all cool in the gang. Be interesting. I think uh, Woody hates it around here, so um, <laughs> not. <laughs> oh dear. Okay, so Ginger Ninja has changed his car. It's like a, some sort of GT40, is that? Yep. Love the GT40, what a motor that is. <laughs> yeah, okay, by actually move just uh, <laughs> uh, suggesting that he might have had the odd tap or two up the backside from Ginger Ninja in that last race. <laughs> I think uh, absolutely spot on. So we're just having five minutes of practice. So we're not really going to get a uh, good idea of uh, who's quick round here. Well, I suspect Widdy probably is.
Maguire is back in the Alpine. Okay, by Ashimaru sticks to his guns, and we are off by the look of it. Here we go. Standing start with full start check. Hands on the handbrake, guys. And they're away. So Spiffy G's changed his car by the way. <laughs> Ginger Ninja had the most sluggish of starts. What's the... Oh, okay. So Spiffy G has suddenly remembered he's got a Ferrari P30, P330, P4. No, 330P4, whatever it's bloody called. Quite sure why it took him so long to remember that, but um, there, we, there we go. So we got oh, three Ferraris, three wide, all flummox each other, and the Shaguar goes absolutely storming through. Or does it? No, okay, well, up into second. Epic stuff. Oh, it's great seeing these cars uh, flying around these tracks. Brilliant stuff. Okay, Spiffy is in a hurry to get past Witty by the look of it. You have a very shiny helmet this evening, uh, Spiffy. Have you been polishing it a lot? It's all going on here. Spiffy is up into second. He's into uh, first. Crikey. Oh, no, second. Uh, James absolutely flies off the track. So he, he must pick up a penalty there, surely. That's going to be a one-second one as well, I'd have thought. Or did someone tap him? Okay, no penalty. So I think he must have been tagged. The algorithm got it right for us. Splatter goes flying up. <laughs> Nearly T-bones James. Misses his breaking point entirely. <laughs> Epic. Great stuff. Oh, dear. Uh, so, Winnie has picked up a half-second penalty. So, are the Ferraris... Are they going to break through? They completely knock each other off. So, oh, dearie me. Well, well done, lads. That, that, was, that worked like a charm, didn't it? Uh. <laughs> so it's Italy versus England. It's the Italian job all over again. I should be play playing the uh, self-preservation society, really. Brilliant stuff. So when he served his penalty, has he lost out to Splatter? No. They've both gone wide there. So it's, God, it's got to be a penalty, surely. And Splat is trying to force his way up the inside. This is close. I'm just going to pop back in the interest of uh, fairness. So we've got a MacGyver, head of Kobayashi Maru, head of <laughs> Ginger Ninja, who's uh, probably uh, questioning his car choice again this evening. OK, so it's Spiffy G and... Big Easy fighting it out in the uh, 330p4s up front. Willie's picked up another penalty. Oh, the Tifosi are going to go mad if they bring home a 1 2 3 here. Really taking a super wide line into uh, that particular corner there, which I can't remember what the name is, but this one's called Rauch, or Smoke, I believe. Is the uh, translation. <laughs> Spiffy G flies wide. <laughs> Willie really served his penalty. Rob is coming through, but is it enough? I don't think it is. No. 
Yeah, it's a bit of a shitty place for the penalty line there, to be honest. You don't really end up losing anything. It's not like at Monza or, you know, where you absolutely get caned. But uh, ho hum, off they go. Come on, Rob. We want a Ferrari one, two, three here. Uh, no offence, Will. Oh, beautiful through there from Will. Taking a super wide line into the hairpin again. And oh God, he's gone past Big Easy. Like, like, uh, spiffy there, like he was standing still. Fantastic move from Will there. He certainly seems to have got to grips with the uh, Shaguar. And looks like he's trying to come up the inside of Big Easy now. Yep, yeah, well, he's done him. That's... <laughs> Spiffy G comes flying through the inside there. What a move that was. Absolutely superb. The Ferraris aren't giving this up without a fight. There is absolutely point. There's a second between the top four. Absolutely amazing. Uh, so Kobayashi Maru is 10 back, four ahead of MacGyver, who slipped back to sixth, and Ginger Ninja, <laughs> who, uh, yeah, I think, I think he might have had enough to some uh, unfortunate car choices. So Big Easy is now into first. Christ almighty, don't take your eyes off this, folks. Okay, so we have the Ferrari 123 at the moment, although Splatter's got a six-second penalty. What the hell happened there? Oh, my God! <laughs> oh, God! <laughs> it's the wacky races. Jesus Christ almighty. That was absolutely extraordinary. <laughs> okay, so uh, I have to say at the moment, Odds on Willie Ham is uh, taking his third win. <laughs> third win of the evening. <laughs> oh my god. It, it, that, that, actually, that's, that's kind of typical of Ferrari team orders at the moment, I think. Yeah, just smash into each other and take each other off and uh, yeah, let someone else win. Seems to be about right. Um, Oh my god, that was hilarious. I've been saving this replay for sure just to watch that corner alone. Uh, absolutely superb. Yeah, well, he's definitely got the uh, the makings of this girl this evening, although Big Easy seems to have finally got his uh, head around the Ferrari as well. So uh, this will be a cracking battle here. Splatter's four back. Spiffy's five back from Splatter. I will have to ask James what his thoughts were on the, of what he was thinking of uh, with that particular livery. Not sure. Not keen. And good evening to everyone watching. Five watching this evening for our impromptu uh, commentary on our historic heroes events. So thank you all for uh, taking time out of your evening to uh, join us. Uh, Three watching now, so <laughs> obviously some shrinking violets who don't like uh, the attention. So, um, yeah, please do say hello, pop us a uh, yeah, whatever in the chat. I will do my best to keep on top of it. So we've got about six minutes left. So what's that about? Four laps. Uh, Big Easy has picked up a half second penalty. Mm, yeah. I think James will be spewing as well because he, I reckon he might have fancied himself for a win or two here. But okay, so they're just coming up on the back of 
Is that Ginger Ninja? Yeah, okay, so he's gone straight on. Okay, well, uh, Willie actually made a bit of a ricket to that corner. But his nearest competitor has a half-second penalty, so I'm sure he's not feeling too bad about it. Taking that ridiculously wide line again through the uh, right-hander. <laughs> Ginger Ninja... <laughs> Uh, into the uh, kitty litter again. Have to say that Shaguar is probably the best looking car on track this evening. It's absolutely immense. Good choice, Will. Good choice. I think it only cost him 20 million credits as well. So, uh, yeah, as soon as one pops up, because uh, I'm old money bags on the credits front, because I'd never buy cars. Uh, I might buy two, in fact. James is only 2.3 seconds behind. Oh, that was close. Okay. Drop back to two and a half. Okay, let's see where Splatter is. Five, so he's a bit in no man's land. Five behind Big Easy and five ahead of Spiffy G, who's ten ahead of MacGyver. Who's okay? So we've got the uh, Alpines again. Are oh, the race on track? And MacGyver's got a one second penalty. He's got quite a long way ahead. The shitty position that that uh, penalty line is at, he might be okay, but uh, we will see very shortly. Alpine looks like a sort of a kit car that your dad put together in his garage, doesn't it? Terrible. Okay, here we go. This is for fifth. With three minutes left. Yeah, I think he's, yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay, by Ashley Maru. Sling it. God, he's thrown it on the inside there. Wow, okay. Mm. Okay, yeah. Did a naughty, so he's pulled over and let MacGyver back. Oh, no. <laughs> what the hell? Oh, dear. I think MacGyver must have lost concentration and uh, stuck a tyre. Stuck his ass in the grass. Um, so, <laughs> God, go by Shibiru's just... Uh, yeah. Done likewise. Oh, well, no, they're both being too polite now. So, come on, boys. After you. New, no, after you. Okay. Well, that's the Battle of the Alpines over and done with. Ginger Ninja still... Uh, really have has pulled out a nine-second lead. And now the race on track is between... Yeah, uh, it's between P2 and 3... Big Easy and Splatter, who's having <laughs> one of the best drives of his uh, life this evening. Absolutely loves that Ferrari, clearly, because he's been up in amongst the uh, lead every single race. Fantastic. Big Easy to go wide. Is, it, is this an opportunity for Splatter to take him? Must be. Goes defensive. Boo, James. And... Uh, <laughs> Splatter misses his breaking point, getting a bit over eager there, but no, goes past him. Although it's going to be. Oh no, okay, so James tucks in behind, coming into. Uh, okay, throws it up the inside, but goes wide, and Splatter goes through. This is your last lap, guys. I'm not sure Willie will make it through for another one. No, no chance. <laughs> Just 
had enough. So I don't think what he's going to... No, he's miles away. Okay. So Splatter. Going through Rauk. Into the next left-hander. Spiffy Cheese catching up slightly with the shenanigans between these two. Follow James through the final corner. Well done, Splatter. Another second place. James into third. Spiffy G into fourth. MacGyver's... <laughs> <laughs> They've both got half second penalties. Wow. Okay. And they made it across the start finish line to, to do the last lap. <laughs> Ginger Ninja is wreaking havoc. Is this is this good? <laughs> okay, no, no, he, he held that. Well done, Simon. Good work. They've both got a half second penalty to serve. I don't see the countdown starting. Oh, okay. No, there it is. As if by magic, the shopkeeper appears. Okay, so it looks like MacGyver's got this fifth place in the bag. <laughs> just just drifting, drifting through the... Uh, uh, Hairpin there. Lovely stuff. No, but guy was crikey. He took that tight. Oh, no, he's picked up. No, oh, God. So I think penalties are doubled when you get to the line. So this could be curtains for MacGyver. Yeah, OK. Beautifully done there, Ginger Ninja. Well done. <laughs> there you have it. Uh, very... Uh, very eventful uh, third race and frankly a very eventful evening so uh, if you did join us thank you so much if you're watching on uh, obviously if you re on watching on replay thank you so much for watching don't forgive us don't forget to give us a like and do subscribe to the channel if you're able because it would mean the world to us uh helps with the visibility of our league and whatnot so um Thank you so much. Now, so the uh, race three this evening in first place. <laughs> Willie Ham in the Shaguar. Uh, and the best lap of a 128.999. Good stuff. Uh, Splatter in second in the Ferrari 330p4. Uh, best lap of 130.4. Big Easy in third, a 129.8. Spiffy G in fourth, a 129.9. Close between those two there. Uh, Kobay Ashimaru in fifth in the Alpine, a 132.9. MacGyver in sixth in the Alpine, a 133.1. And Ginger Ninja in seventh. <laughs> Who, yeah, a not a great car choice again, but uh, congratulations for your performance this evening. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I might just have to go and have a quick chat and it's not with, with just to see. Uh, yeah, see how the. Uh, Guys are getting on. Uh, party voice chat. There we go. Unmute everyone. There we go. Everyone's still there. Excellent. Good evening. Good evening. Hi, mate. Evening. Evening. That was a hoot. That was a hoot. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, Willie, you looked like you uh, you really really got to grips with that Jag. I think, without realising it, I picked the uh, the right car there. Yeah, it, it looked magnificent. It was, um, to be fair. Good all rounder. Uh, yeah. 
yeah, it was the great. Ferraris were faster on the straight, but I had the the brakes. I had a, I had a lot on the brakes and in the corners. I had a lot more. Yeah, I noticed that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it was good fun. That. Good stuff. Good stuff. So big easy. How was it for you this evening? Well, I was all right until somebody was started slaughtering me and my beautiful livery. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I I barely mentioned it. What are you talking about? <laughs> that was an absolute abortion. What the hell's going on with that a livery? It's terrible. They were Boston races. There was no um, there was no touching that jag. Uh, you had to. You just ended up overdriving the Ferrari, so you just had to fucking let it go once it got past. <laughs> but Rob, what the hell, man? What have you been taking? <laughs> well, quite. And, 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 and so say all of us, Splatter. What are you on this evening? Uh, this evening? Uh, yeah. <laughs> that, I don't know. Some of the edibles I sent him. I mean, anything uh, I normally must be like Viagra or something, but in typical fashion, I uh, finished too soon and couldn't uh, maintain any stamina. Couldn't finish the job. <laughs> So, <laughs> oh, oh. Insert, that's what she said, Jill. <laughs> well, well I think Rob is on chart, but somebody else is oh, driving. It looked like well, you were being I, a little bit too generous to me there, to be honest, James, but uh, I'll take it nonetheless. I appreciate it. Thanks. I'm, I'm definitely, I'm definitely going to watch the replay because I was calling a Ferrari one, two, three, and then you all, in one bloody corner, basically took each other out. <laughs> Will went flying went past, and I was like, for Christ's sake! <laughs> Yeah, I think I, I sort of sent it rather too late on the uh, corner up the hill, and um, yeah, nearly took everybody out. Which um, it, was, it was fun. Yeah, it was very entertaining to watch. So well done, all. Uh, MacGyver, a couple of different cars this evening. Yeah, nothing, nothing to compete. So I was just fussing around. Okay, it's just uh, having a bit of a laugh. Yeah, those yeah, those expensive cars I just don't have. It's, uh, but yeah, it was fun. Good, 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 good. And, um, and uh, we'll, we'll finish up with um, Ginger Ninja. Some excellent yeah. choices of cars this evening. I went for beauty over speed, my friend. You did, you did, and uh, some, some, ma some magnificent, <laughs> some magnificent <laughs> drifting. <laughs> I won't mind, but I've got a Dino 246, a 365 GTB4, but the 1971, so I can't use them. I think it's scandalous. I don't think any of us would have known that. No. Oh, indeed. Oh, but, uh, but uh, look, uh, uh, thank you, guys. I, mean, I know it's a bit of an impromptu stream this evening, but uh, it was an absolute hoot to watch, and I hope you all enjoyed it. Splatter, great drive, mate. Willie, congratulations on your wins. Uh, big Easy, don't use that livery again. Um, <laughs> but thank you all for joining. Thank you all for racing. It's been an absolute hoot. It's the first livery that's had any attention. <laughs> it was all bad though. <laughs> There's no bad publicity. <laughs> right, okay. I'll, I'll, I'll bear that in uh, mind for future streams. <laughs> hey, thanks, thanks for the impromptu commentary, Mark. Yeah, uh, you know, you're more than welcome, guys. It was it was an absolute hoot. So uh, yes, uh, good. Yeah, yeah, we're live now, mate. So, Hello, world. <laughs> yes, indeed. Hi, Mark's Hello, all three yes, indeed. people. <laughs> Hello, Mrs. Hello, Burnoff again. Hello, five viewers. Yeah, indeed. Right. Exactly. Well, look, thanks, everyone. Uh, do like and subscribe. And, uh, yeah, we'll see you at the next one. Good effort. Cheers, guys. Cheers, guys. Cheers, Mark. See ya.